Hello and welcome to another Easy Digitals tutorial. Today I'm going to talk about our Invincible poster and remember you can purchase any of our templates at is easydigitals.com and click on the shopping link. Also remember to sign up for our, our email list and you can receive free monthly templates and tutorials. And this month it's these little bunny ears here. So let's go ahead and get started by closing out this window. This is our Invincible poster. Um, now that spring is here, a lot of people have been asking if this poster comes in other sports besides football. It does not, but I want to show you how you can make this poster into baseball today and then you can use that to make it into any other sport. So by the time we're finished, it's going to look like this. And I'm going to go ahead and close this out. Okay, so this is what the template will look like when it first comes up. And I always like to have my show transform controls and auto select layer check marked. And I like to have my layers palette open. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is turn off these layers with the words on them for what we're doing. And I'm going to open up the photo I chose for my stadium. And one quick tip for you is that whenever you're going to use a photo like this to add to a template, always use the thumbnail from the template company like iStock or DreamsTime properly before you actually buy the high resolution photo. Because sometimes you think a photo will work and then after you try it, you realize it doesn't. For example, I used, I tried this one and I tried this one and I didn't like the way they looked so uh, then I tried this one and I like the way it looked so I'm going to go ahead and use that one for this. Okay so this is the photo I'm going to add and here I'm going to come over to my template and highlight the stadium and I'm just going to drag my picture in. Oh. I'm going to go ahead and lock this so it doesn't move on me, this layer on the bottom. All right, here's my stadium. Now back to my first stadium. I'm going to go ahead and drag a ruler out from this ruler area just so I can see the top of this layer. Okay, now I'm going to bring this up here and I'm just going to drag it down. I press my shift key while I'm dragging so that it doesn't distort it and press enter. And right now the photo filter and brightness is on and I'm going to go ahead and leave brightness on. And I'm just going to move this layer and I'm going to highlight these three four layers. Right click create clipping mask and there it is. And then you can adjust it with your arrows, move it right and left until you like it. And it's that easy to add a different stadium. Now this stadium was from Dreams Time. I will add the, the information in the notes. I'm going to go ahead and um, customize the rest of this to make it look like a baseball poster. So I'm going to open up my, ba my baseball player and I want to drag him into the right position. So your photo here and then just drag it over and that has the photo filter on. So I'm going to turn that off. And a little bit of the check checkered here showing that the background is showing. So I need to make this bigger and I'm just going to zoom out so I'm doing alt and I'm just going to make this bigger. Shift drag the corners press enter and then let's look at it go ahead and change it to baseball and you can either make this bigger or you can come over to the paragraph to the character and expand this like this and then you can just customize the player's name and that's all there is to it it's pretty simple let me know if you have any questions and enjoy the template